The FBI is on the hunt for this man, 29-year-old Liban Haji Mohammed, a Somali-born naturalized U.S. citizen, the latest addition to the agency's list of most wanted terrorists. What makes Mohammed of special interest? His last job, three years as a cab driver in the D.C. area and the terror group in Africa that the FBI says he joined. That group is known as al-Shabaab, behind the deadly 2013 Westgate Mall attack in Kenya. According to the FBI, Mohammed is believed to have left the U.S. with the intent to join al-Shabaab in East Africa and is currently there operating on behalf of that terrorist organization. That attack in Kenya, an especially horrific, deadly attack. There were three gunmen, at least, who stormed the mall with, with very heavy weaponry, uh, and they just fired uh, with, with these automatic weapons uh, into crowds of people, trying to kill just as many people uh, as they uh, could. In a statement, the FBI says that before joining that group in Africa, Mohammed was a recruiter and a radicalizer for the terror group while working as a cab driver in Washington, D.C. If he has connected with, with al-Shabaab, and that appears to be the suspicion, uh, then he has knowledge uh, of Washington, D.C., of, of uh, important landmarks uh, in the city. Obviously, taxi drivers know their way around. And now, the fear that Mohammed, an American citizen, could return to this country and launch terror attacks against the U.S. Well, the FBI says that Mohammed has provided support and resources to al-Qaeda. Uh, they say the reason why it's so critical to locate him is because of his knowledge of the D.C. area.